This is a KGUN 9 Now news update. Hello, I'm Lydia Camarillo. We learned that Lou Olson passed away last night, just days after he was put into hospice care. While he is a legend in the sports world, he is also known as being part of the soul of Tucson. He was regarded as one of college basketball's greatest coaches of all time. He led the Wildcats to four Final Four appearances, including a national championship and an amazing 23 consecutive NCAA tournament appearances. And get this, it all happened after he got to Tucson when he was close to 50 years old. Old. Growing to love it here in the Old Pueblo, Olsen would go on to turn down other college opportunities and even offers from the NBA. Here's what he had to say during a 2016 interview about his role at the University of Arizona. I love coaching college guys because they, you can just see them grow from kids to, to young men before, before they move on. He came to Tucson in 1983 and took the Wildcats to their first Final Four appearance. Just five years later, they won a national championship under Olsen in 1997. He retired in 2008 after coaching into his 70s. Let's take another look at his accomplishments. Olsen was inducted into the Memorial Basketball Hall of Fame in 2002 and the National Collegiate Basketball Hall of Fame in 2006 and was just re-inducted last year in 2019. He also received the Naismith Award for Outstanding Contribution to Men's College Basketball in 2013. We saw this last night and this morning. Fans heading out to the Memorial on the U of A campus to pay their respects, leave flowers and honor the legend that Olsen Olson was. We don't know much about the condition that he was suffering from or the reason he was put into hospice care earlier this week, but we do know he hasn't been seen in public since having a minor stroke last year. As for any funeral arrangements or memorial services, it's still very early, so we don't know that information yet, but we'll continue to update you as soon as we learn much more. Here's your forecast. Staying hot today with only a slight chance for isolated afternoon and evening storms, plus near record heat, but rain chances, they go up over the weekend thanks to some tropical help. Along with the high rain chances, highs will dip to the 90s with storms possible through Monday of next week.